Hi guys, my name is Murli Dev and my name is Ketan and today we'll be discussing the easiest and the hardest problem from the uh, Ramanujan contest junior section. So let's start. So what do you think was the easiest problem? Uh, I guess the fourth one. Yeah, so let's just try. Yeah, so in this question, it's saying that in the diagram, it's given that uh, ABC and PQ are equilateral triangles. So that implies that the angle, uh, all the angles in the triangles are 60 and the sides yeah. are equal. And they're asking us to find CXY. CXY is with this one, this angle. They just start randomly marking angles. Yeah. So this is given as 65. So this is 60. So this will be uh, one. Right straight, man. Okay. So this is 65, so this is 60 and this is uh, 180 minus 125 and which is equal to uh, 55. So this angle is 55 and again we, we can do over here, this is 60, this is 60, this is 60 degree and again this is, uh, yeah, this is 135, 180 minus 135 which is equal to 40. So we know this angle is 45 degrees. So let's find this. Yeah, we can B find by this. P. Or else we can, yeah, we can directly find this also. Yeah, so yeah, that is uh, angle B by P is equal to 180 times minus 55 plus 45. It's directly from the fact that uh, some of the angle in a triangle is 180 degrees. So this is uh, 100, this is 180, so it is 80 degrees. So this is 80 and even this is 80 because they are vertically opposite yeah. angles. Now we we know that ABC is equal to ACB is 60 correct, degrees. Correct. So from this we can directly find out what is CXY. So angle CXY is equal to uh, uh, it is 180 is equal to 180 minus 60 plus 80 and 60 plus 80 is nothing but 140 so it's 180 minus 140 that is 40 degrees final answer yeah so the final answer is this is equal to 40 degrees Done. so what do you think was the toughest question uh, I think the 11th one yeah. Yeah. Something what we take for granted. Yeah. yeah. They're asking us to prove that. Oh, it's already there. Yeah. Yeah. So let's just draw an accurate diagram. So so angle. We need to prove that BC is greater than AC. So first, it's given that angle A is greater than B. Yeah. So in this, A is greater Correct. than B. Correct. Better to make this B. Why? Because this is like a smaller one, right? Like. Yeah. 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 B. C. Yeah. So this is our diagram. So we need to prove that A, B C is greater than A C. Correct. So my first instinct was if B C greater than A C, then B C should be we should be able to write it as sum of A B plus some positive. Correct. Correct. Yeah. yeah. That is one way of proving that something is greater. So if we uh, transfer A B on, we need to do it in a smart way. Um, let's just let's just try transferring directly. You can uh, make a circle, right? You can yeah, make a circle. Yeah. You mean... Um, Centered at B and radius is BA. Correct. Uh, in other words, let me just construct AM. So, construction. We construct AM such that MAB is 90 minus B by 2. AM, yeah. 90 minus B by 2. 
then this is b correct so yeah. by angle sum even this comes out to be 90 minus b by 2 so it automatically becomes a yeah yeah, yeah. isosceles yes yes but the question is can we get a, such a construction or will the construction go something like this like will am go outside the triangle or will it lie inside the triangle that is important right yeah 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 so if am has to lie inside the triangle then what should be our criteria so b should be less than 90 No, but even if ah, ah, correct, correct, yeah, even it should be inside A angle A. Correct, correct. Yeah, wait. We can write an equation and see. I think I did something wrong. One second. Let's call this B. You know, something will go wrong. Yeah. Okay, you want to construct in such a way that yeah, yeah. Okay. It will be helpful yeah. later. Yeah, ninety minus c by two here. Yeah. So, uh, so this A M will lie inside the triangle only if uh, A greater than ninety minus c by two. Correct, correct. Yeah. Which is not apparent. We need to prove yeah, yeah, this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, let us take what is given. A is greater than B. Can we somehow manipulate that? Uh, we can write c by two in terms of A B. Correct. Yeah, then we can do and, some. I mean, we can just multiply by two, right? So yeah. this is if and only if two a greater than one a minus c, yeah. and we spot angle sum property. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is if and only if two a greater than a plus b. Yeah, yeah. This is if and only if a greater than b. Yes. Which is true. Yeah. So we can run the argument backwards. Yes. All yes, of this yes, should yes, be yeah, true. Correct, so a yeah. greater than ninety minus c. Yeah, two. yeah. So this indeed lies inside the triangle. Yeah, correct. Angle. Yeah. Yeah. Now I think we are done. AC is equal to this. Yeah, this is an I isosceles triangle, triangle yeah. by construction. So we can write BC as um, AM plus CM. Yeah, MC, MC plus BM. Correct. But And MC is AC. AC. Yeah. AC plus BM. Yeah. So BC is some positive quantity. Correct. Correct. Yeah. BM plus BC. So I'm yeah, so oh, sorry. Plus AC. So BC has to be greater. Correct. Correct. Yeah. So Ram, the Ramanujan contest is an excellent contest for students who are interested in uh, uh, non-routine mathematics and want to develop their skills in it. Uh, the next Ramanujan Junior contest is on uh, May twenty second. That is uh, uh, the coming Sunday. So students, so uh, those who are interested, can register by clicking the link in the description. And all the students who answer eighty percent of the tests get their registration fee refunded back. Yeah, thanks for joining.